Greetings. In um, researching early American imprints, um, the series with Shaw Shoemaker from 1801 to 1819, there looks into early natural period within American history. Um, one of the pamphlets that I found that would be um, good for teaching especially a social studies or African-American history course would be Davis Walker's appeal to the color citizens of the world. Um, the pedagogy that I would utilize within these courses, I will put emphasis on how Mr. Walker was able to articulate the misconceptions and the differences within the Declaration of Independence. Within his article or his pamphlet to the colored citizens of the world, Mr. Walker use, utilizes strong language and he articulates himself to appeal to the notion that at this time in the 1800s, African Americans were oppressed and in slavery. And his ability to connect the Christian perspective and also tie in the Declaration of Independence will be will serve well as manners in which to teach an African American um, history class african-american literature class or even um uh, uh english course with afrocentric themes um for example in his letter he says i also asked the attention of the world of mankind to the decoration of these very american people of the united states a decoration made july 4th 1776 it says when in the course of human events it becomes necessary for one people to dissolve the political bands which have connected them with another and to assume among the powers of the earth the separate and equal station to which the laws of the nature and natures of god entitle them so Mr. Walker's appeal to the colored citizens of the world was arguably, arguably the most radical and anti-slave document published in September 1829. With his articulation, he was able to galvanize many of black um, slaves and those who had escaped slavery and his appeal was so impactful that it became material that was banned under the law. So as the material, the pamphlet began to circulate in areas like Virginia and Louisiana and um, Georgia, those who were caught in possession of this pamphlet um, were incarcerated or beaten, and some even were killed just for being in possession of this pamphlet. So part of the pedagogy that I would implement would show how important protest literature would be for the movement of any people. And, this, and, and that's really the, the, the critical piece in this literature of protest that Mr. Walker um, created, he connected other well-received literatures of protests like the Declaration of Independence. And he showed how if America can want a disconnect with Great Britain, then African Americans can also want a disconnect with America. So thank you.